Our next set of awards recognizes three of our most outstanding cooperating attorneys who have dedicated their time and talent to helping complainants, testers, and our organization obtain justice by achieving favorable case outcomes and ultimately greater compliance with the law. We truly have some of the most skilled fair housing attorneys in the nation working on our cases. And I will tell you, because our board interacts with these lawyers a lot, that they are not only superb legal minds, but they are great strategists and organizers, and they are real fighters for the cause. Our first awardee is the Director of Litigation for Disability and Aging Rights at Mobilization for Justice, formerly MFY Legal Services, Kevin Kremen. <laughs> Kevin has dedicated his career to enforcing fair housing rights and disability rights. Not only has Kevin skillfully handled a variety of cases for FHJC and its clients, but Kevin has been the primary person conducting compliance training for defendants in FHJC fair housing cases that have been resolved over the past decade. Kevin has established himself as a national legal expert in disability, disability issues, and the FHJC is so fortunate to have him as a cooperating attorney and training resource. In honor of your years of service to the FHJC, we present this award for outstanding fair housing attorney to Kevin Kremen. Thank you, Kevin, and congratulations. Our second awardee is another exemplary attorney who has dedicated her entire professional career to advancing fair housing, Diane Houck. <laughs> Diane is of counsel at Emory, Chelly, Brinkerhoff, and Abadie where she specializes in housing discrimination matters. Diane donates hundreds of pro bono hours to the organization, providing legal assistance, training, and support to the board and staff. She is a co-founder and first executive director of the Fair Housing Justice Center. Since returning to private practice in 2008, Diane has successfully handled dozens of cases for the Fair Housing Justice Center and our clients, and has, has obtained some of the most expansive and creative remedies. For example, just today, we announced the largest settlement that the Fair Housing Justice Center has obtained in a private rental discrimination case involving race and source of income discrimination. <laughs> Diane represented the Fair Housing Justice Center and three African-American testers, and Kevin, our first honoree, represented the bona fide home seeker in this case. Suffice it to say, if we listed all of Diane's legal accomplishments for, the, for fair housing, we would be here all evening. <laughs> in honor of your years of service to the Fair Housing Justice Center, we present this award for outstanding fair housing attorney to Diane Houck. Congratulations. And our third awardee is a founding partner of Cutie Hecker Wong, Marianne Meyer Wong. Marianne has been litigating civil rights cases for more than 20 years. From the time she was a law student, she has worked to combat housing discrimination. Today, she handles a myriad of cases on issues such as sexual and racial assaults and harassment, housing, lending, and employment discrimination, labor law violations, police misconduct, First Amendment protections, prisoners' rights, and LGBTQ discrimination. Mary Ann has also successfully handled dozens of cases for the FHJC and our clients, and she has obtained some amazing remedies in these cases. For example, last month she resolved a race discrimination case brought by the FHJC and three African-American testers against a bank. 
In that case, not only did FHJC obtain damages, but each of the three testers obtained $28,000 in damages, which is believed to be the highest reported damages for testers in the nation resulting from federal litigation. In honor of your years of service to the FHJC, we present this award for outstanding fair housing attorney to Marianne Meyer Wong. Congratulations. <laughs>